All right, family. They definitely killing me with these goddamn taxes. Somebody definitely smoked. See, I done figured it out. I'm paying and they playing. You understand what I'm saying? Now these glasses I usually can get for about five dollars. Shit was nine ninety nine plus tax. Eleven oh two. So you know I didn't pay the two cent and I found the penny on the way out. You understand what I'm saying? But not only that, goddamn. I'm getting sick of this shit. For real. I'm on a fucking budget. But everybody know me from my glasses. So You know, I gotta keep switching up. Let them know I'm cool, nigga. For real. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I remember I was on drugs back in the day. And my ex-girlfriend, Donna Marie Evans. See, somebody need a drink. They open like a motherfucker. Well, that's where all that fucking goddamn tax shit coming from. You see the safe haven? Now, I went to safe haven up north not to fucking drink, drug, or smoke. Look, look how they doing your girl. See, they be up early. Is that Queen Latifah? I knew they was coming after you, Queen. Look. See? They got you in the garbage. You know what I'm saying? It's the queendom. Or oh, it pays to get the fuck up here. Yeah. So, yeah, I went, I went up north, you know, to get off of drugs and alcohol. You know, because I used to be on, you know, drugs because of my ex-girlfriend. Donna Marie Evans trying to turn my ass out into a crackhead and all kind of other shit. You understand what I'm saying? That's so she could get my legacy and shit. So I remember she bought me a, a leather coat. For real. I thought I was, you know, a mafia person or something when I wore that motherfucker. You understand what I'm saying? I, I was cool. I had made a hat, right, to go with it. Ah, oh, I was shitty shocked, nigga. You couldn't tell me fucking nothing. You understand what I'm saying? Real tough, but I went on you no know, drugs then. But when I did get on drugs because of her, and I'm gonna say that for real, you know what I'm saying? Or trying to figure out what the fuck going on with my people on drugs. Cause, you know, I ain't stay on that shit long. I end up selling that coat. It cost about $400. I sold it. For about seventy-five dollars at Shelley's loan place that is no longer open. They didn't cash out, but it's down there. Now, if my first ever YouTube video, I was wearing a red, black, and green coat in it. You know, Oprah, uh, Mary Mac versus the fat black Oprah Winfrey. If it was red, black, and green, how is it that I got my ass whooped wearing that same coat on the west side of Chicago doing Black History Month? You know what I'm saying? I mean, if they really appreciated me, why the fuck am I going through hell? Huh? That's all I want to know. See? Because they want to take over my America, the red, white, and the blue. But now I'm going to make it the, the pink and the blue. You understand what I'm saying? I'm going to make it the pink, the red, and the blue. That's, that's the new colors for America. No, pink, maroon, and blue. There you go. Real talk. Pink, maroon, and blue. That's the new American colors in my book. You understand what I'm saying? Pink, maroon, and blue. Yeah, so I sold that damn coat somewhere down here for $75. It was a nice little leather coat too, for real. 
Real talk. And for some reason, these motherfuckers think, you know, I'm just supposed to give them my motherfucking shit. You understand what I'm saying? For free. So that's why they keep moving the nigga and shit. Now, I don't know why the fuck they sold this motherfucker or trying to sell it. It was booming. Not only that, this is where they made the Blues Brothers at. Real tough. When you seen Ray Charles in there playing the piano and the little boy was trying to steal something and he thought Ray Charles didn't see him and he shot that motherfucker gun. Yeah, this is where they made the Blues Brothers at. Well, because motherfuckers think I'm stupid. You understand what I'm saying? I gotta play stupid sometimes. You know, sometimes you gotta get a little ignorant in order to, uh, so basically, this is a legendary building. It's a historical building. Real talk, all bullshit aside, for real. This is a historical building. Worth a lot of money, just like uh, the Regal Theater right off of 79th and Stone. And I guarantee you, my people got something to do with it and shit. So if they can get it for a little bit of nothing, kill, kill your girl, then, you know, they didn't came up, I guess. You know, everybody wants something for free. But that's what's going to get them killed. Because ain't shit free. Somebody paid the price. You understand what I'm saying? One way or the other. So... You know, all you out of town motherfuckers that think you know some shit because you listen to my videos and you listen to all the rest of them and shit. You understand what I'm saying? That came before me or that's coming after me or whatever the fuck may be. Yeah. You know, don't get it twisted, motherfucker. I'm still here. When I die, we all die. Fucking toe. Yep. That's the truth. See, they trying to bring this Bitcoin shit. Get rid of all the motherfucking goddamn um, cash and bring in the digital mint. You understand what I'm saying? Because they know cash rule everything around us for real. So they trying to change the currency and all that. You understand what I'm saying? Because, you know, they trying to eliminate motherfuckers and bring in the historic black metropolis metropolis whatever you understand what I'm saying look I got a little black in me nigga but at the end of the day I'm a Native American okay real motherfucking talk real talk you know what I'm saying these are the rainbow colors okay these are the original rainbow colors and I didn't realize this until you know last year sometime See the brown, the pink, the purple, the blue, the green, the yellow, the orange, and the motherfucking red. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Those are my uh, rainbow colors. But they try to keep the the pink and the and the brown out and just bring in the fucking black. You understand what I'm saying? You know, and I ain't that damn black, man. For real. And I definitely ain't black and white. For real. Real motherfucking talk. Black is death. For real. Look it up in the dictionary. It is not a good thing. So when motherfuckers say black, 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 that's too much fucking black. For real. I didn't see no fucking black in a fucking rainbow. Now, y'all fucking goddamn it. If you smart, motherfucker, next time you see a rainbow, look for black. And if it's there, then you can have my fucking story. If not, Kick fucking rocks, motherfucker. You see the black and white shoe, shoe avenue existed ever since 1983, which is probably not true. And you see the three, the two and the three. See, that's the month and the day that my mama's supposed to have died. Mo March the 23rd. You know what I'm saying? Now, my mama, see, with that black and white shit probably, because she can't keep up with this new wave of information. You understand what I'm saying? And you know, they'll bring back that old shit with my money. So even I say even my mama, I, I got to keep an eye on them. You know what I'm saying? Real choke. Now, we all can make money, but you're not going to eliminate my motherfucking history, my legacy, because, you know, you missed the boat. I came back for you. You understand what I'm saying? You never took care of me, and then you make it on your own. I'm talking about me. Then they get mad at that. So all my real DCFS people out there, watch the company you keep. 
And if they say, and if they say, they your mama or your family and shit, watch they ass too, for real, real motherfucking tote. Y'all see it for yourself. It's in black and white. I can't make this shit up. All right, family. Let me move on. I don't trust nobody. It's too much money.